Adam and Samantha. Have you come here to enter marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? I have. Although I learned these funny things about Samantha, what I really learned about her when we lived together in college was that she was the most reliable person I could ever count on. Sam is the strong, silent type who never wants to be the center of attention, but is always there caring for others. And if you know Samantha, you know that she always has your back. I've learned a lot from Adam just by him being the man that he is. He's just a stand-up guy, and uh, obviously that got him to here where he's marrying Samantha, who is a beautiful, kind, obviously patient woman. I remember when Adam was a newborn. Sally Kafkaris came over to see the new baby. She looked at me and she said, well now Lana, you know what it feels like to have your heart walking outside your body. All I really want to say is if I had anyone in, in this world to trust my heart to, it would be Samantha. I've known Adam for many years and uh, over the last few years, I've watched the way that he cares for and takes care of his dad. Having witnessed this, I know that Samantha chose well. I'm so glad that she finally married the man that she was always meant to marry. Way back from elementary school to now, we always kind of knew that they would end up together. They just had to finally figure it out. I, Adam, take you, Samantha, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. To the both of you, I could not be more excited for you to experience how wonderful marriage is. Samantha, I see the compassion you show your students at school. And Adam, I see the dedication and pride you have when working on the farm. And I know these traits will help you love and take care of each other so well. Samantha, you are my second of three blessings. And I'm proud to be your father. And it makes me happy to see your dream come true. On behalf of my whole family, um, welcome Samantha because we love her dearly and she fits in like a glove. Anyway, I just wanted to say um, I love you. No matter what, we've always had our back. I love you both, and uh, nothing but the best, so let's raise a glass for the newly couple, and thank you all. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct honor and privilege to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Adam Michael. You may kiss the bride. Cheers to a lifetime of cheesy Adam jokes, Samantha's goofy dance moves, and hopefully lots of children. <laughs>